Hey guys, it's Fred7 here. Welcome back. We're in the painted world, which actually is super cool. I love the textures in the painted world. I think it's extra neat. I use turpentine. Which does 250 more damage to troll. So watch this. Holy shit, dude. Oh, lordy, lordy. You are a beastly yo, ain't you? Wow. What health do these things have? Paint a troll fat, baby. Yeah. I don't even know where I'm supposed to go. Let's just go towards the fucking green arrow, man. Do do do. Oh wait, I'm supposed to go get the right. That's fair. All right, fine. Guessing it's not that way, no. We're gonna keep on trucking. Each brand and we're all up and trucking. Get some turpentine usage out on this motherfucker. Goodness gracious. I did 500 damage with my fucking turpentine shit, and it did nothing. Well, actually, that's not right. Beep. Awesome the sky looks. Painted sky. I like this very much. Get off me, bruh. I gotta, I gotta find this this yo. All right, chill the fuck out. Oh look, there's two. Woo! All right. Hey hey. Get my get my marksman training in. There we go. That helps. I can just pick them off. There's no other use at all for turpentine, so I might as well use it all. Okay. Cool. Gotcha. Whoa! Naughty, naughty, sir. Naughty. Very good painting of a troll. That's, they're a little distorted, I guess, but that happens when you're not really familiar with trolls. Do these ones have the three eyes, too? Ah! Yes, they do. It's pretty janky. It's janky. Sweet. 
Are you over here? Uncomplete. No. Stop it. You're being naughty, sir. Hi. It's like, yeah, can you paint me like a super powerful item that I can take out of this place with me? That would be awesome. Woot! Great. Now. Let's see if I can fast travel my way over here. Oh yeah. Hey buddy. Good work. Now I can paint the portal home. After it's complete, you must go first, or else you'd be stuck in here forever. Okay. Follow me. Wait, what? Neat. Whew. You're alive, my dear. Tavella. Right. Oh, my love. You're home safe. I was, I was so afraid. I was so afraid. If it wasn't for my friend here, you'd be right. Come. You must need food and rest. I will rest. But I must take care of our guest first. I don't know how to thank you. You have a good heart to help me get back home. Well, I'll never forget what you've done for me. You better give Here, me some money. Please take this apron as a token of our friendship. It's not much, but perhaps it will help you in the future. Apron? All I ask in return is to keep the brush's existence secret. If word gets around that I have it, I'm afraid more than a lone cut purse will visit me. That's fair. Whew. Safe journey, sir yo. Sir yo. Sir yo. I like that name. Sorry. Is that a... Am I seeing that right? back and see if old boy's got something to say to us. We'll kind of see what happens.
There's a lesson going on. You're a sneaky looking sort. Uh huh. Before we continue, you should speak to Raminus. Oh. Take care. That's fair. I've done a lot for the guild already, so. I used to think you were a hero. Shut. Oh my gosh. Truly, you are an asset to the guild. I reward you with the rank of wizard and teach you a most powerful spell. Okay. Cool. Bye. Wizard's Fury. I don't even know if I can cast How that. Day greet you, friend? Well, at the worst possible time, the council is in ruin. Not so good. A course of action could not be agreed upon. Some felt that we are in danger of being exterminated and that it is time to fight back. Others felt it appropriate to fight fire with fire, as it were. The council has shattered and artifacts have been lost. The necromancer's amulet and the bloodworm helm have been taken. Bloodworm Helm. A group of mages led by Earl of Jarol took the helm and have retreated to Fort Telemann in an effort to study it further. They hope to learn enough from it to find some way to fight Manny Marco. I tried to dissuade them, but it was no use. I would like the helm returned so that it may be kept safe here in the university. I fear Erlaf has made himself a target for the necromancers. Okay. Karanya insisted on removing it from the university. She said it posed a threat to the safety of the Imperial City. While I do not doubt that she was right, I question whether her motives were genuine. I fear she is not safe from the minions of the King of Worms. She is at Fort Ontem. Help her to see that she should not use the weapons of the enemy, especially out of fear. It was last seen in the possession of Earl of Jarol. He was... Okay. There's been trouble with smugglers and Khajiit bandits in the trans -Nibbon. But Mar Farewell. There's one bandit in Oblivion that I remember, and he he was a Khajiit, and he's like, "Give me everything you've got." Nope. Just kill him. Easy peasy. But which one are we going after first? Let's go do the helm. Let's go get the helm first. <laughs> mm. Oh, shit. Oh, okay. I can just... Mm. Nice. Go north. Caramel brulee. Tastes like caramel popcorn. Not too bad. You can do it, game. What? What, what? I'm not riding my horse out there, though. That's just silly.
Oh, almost there. Almost there. Oh, yeah. Fort Tellyman. Hello. Shit. Necromancer. Silly pants. Silly pants, necromancer. Oh, hi. Shit, I missed. That would have been epic. Epic kill shot. Havest thou arrows? Oh, you're the one with the steel arrows. Got it. Well... We're at the, the fort, but we're out of time, so we'll have to go in it in the next video. So until next time, Bone will be Tuna. We'll see you next video. As always, please like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, we'll see you then.